What is up friends, how are you doing today? My name is the Capri 48 and welcome to my channel. In today's video, I'm bringing you this great emulator called GGPO. Probably some of you already heard about it. And GGPO is actually the um, an emulator that you can actually play online. It's kind of like a 5K or 5K2. And I'm gonna show you how to download it, how to set it up, how to, all that good stuff, okay? So let's go ahead and begin. Um, we're gonna go ahead and right now download, well, the GGPO I already downloaded, okay? Uh, there are two other apps that I recommend for you to download, which is a C Archiver. This one does um, help me organize my, my ROMs, emulators, um, photos, pictures, videos, everything, okay? That's one, and another one that I recommend for you to get in case you're, get, you're running low on storage, it's a cloud storage app called the Mega App. And I believe if you register, uh, it does give you 20 gigs for free and no charge. Okay, so the GGPO is already downloaded and ready. So let's go ahead and um, press play. And this is what you're gonna see. You're gonna um, have a message that says select default ROMs folder. Go ahead and press OK. OK, uh, here I'm just going to go ahead and create a different folder. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, hit the little dots over here, new folder, uh, call it um, ROMs GPO, something like that. OK, just go ahead and uh, press select. On your phone, if it's a newer Android version, you can use. Uh, it's gonna say like use uh, this folder or something like that. Let's press select. Okay, so right now there's no ROMs. So what you can do, just go ahead and press login. If you're not registered for it, go ahead and press register, and it will take you automatically to your email, username, password, and password. Okay. And once you log in, just go back to the to the app. And let me just log in real quick. Okay, it's gonna take a couple of seconds to to load the games. I think if you already have uh, ROMs, you can use them in case um, like offline okay so here we go so these are all the games that are available to play online uh, the most popular one right now it's the uh, king of fighters 2002 magic plus two if you don't have any of the roms uh, that's okay so the, here's a neat trick uh, it's kind of like 5k this is a 5k uh, kind of like a 5k emulator you can play online, like I said. On 5K, uh, if you if you want to play a game, it automatically downloads the ROM or the game that you want to play. So here it's the same system. So all you have to do is just press the three buttons on the top. You're gonna say ROMs JSON URL. Okay. In the notes below, I'm gonna leave a link. Um, it's gonna say ROMs pack. ROMs pack JSON URL. Okay, just go ahead and copy that link. And you, uh, what you're gonna do, you're just gonna go ahead and paste it here. So um, let me see. Um, I think I have it here. There we go. Add. Oh, sorry. So you're gonna press Add. There we go. And the cool thing about this is that all you have to do is just go ahead and go into any game. So let's go into the King of Fighters 2002. Press on it. And what it's doing is gonna download the game automatically for you. You don't have to worry about the BIOS, the ROM or the parent ROM. So we'll just wait till it loads. And there we go. Okay, and it also has an option for a lifetime GGPO plus if you want to support the, the creator. 
so um, it's 449 um, for the lifetime I'm gonna go ahead and do it uh, maybe on my next paycheck <laughs> so uh, if you want to support them you can also do that it also has a patreon I think has patreon uh, so here it is. This is the chat. You can chat with people um, You can just challenge like it says here on, on the thing. It says challenge You want to challenge them? Also, uh, you can go to here users and you can look for all the users I'm not really sure about a or B here on the on the site. I think maybe that's the ranking. I'm not sure and Also, if you hit this you can actually send them up a challenge or you can message them okay here on matches you here in the matches you can see all the the matches that are available okay so let's go ahead and try this one f20 for the match okay, maybe it's not coming okay just to exit just press you're gonna press the screen red button confirm okay let's try another one maybe and here it is uh, well there we go and here you have the who's winning Player two is winning three points and the other one has zero points. Okay, so let me go ahead and exit real quick. And also what you can do, you can go ahead and create your own um, room. So all you have to do is just press play. Let me see. Oh, here you can go AFK. That way you don't have to get any um, Challenges. You got the Neo Geo AS, 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 FTs, unranked. Okay. Yeah, the GGPO input lag. Okay, let's go ahead and try the game. So I'm just gonna go over some of the things that you have on the screen. So here you have your your buttons, joystick coin start okay, over here you have your menu okay you have um, on the three dots like I said you have your auto rotate mute frame skip effect like I said uh, you can change the, the effects right now I have it on none here on the next one which is the little two arrows you can press it and actually moves it around or makes it bigger for you there we go. You want full screen? Okay. So we'll just leave it like that. Uh, the next one you have the the save the save button, so you can save your progress. Also, um, for the little controller, the Nintendo controller, go ahead and press it. And this is the menu that you have. You have vibrate smooth stick uh, stick sensitivity okay um bottom multi-touch i'm not really sure what does that um okay you have the software macro this one uh in case you need two buttons or four buttons three buttons with whatever depending on the character that you have so let's try it out a b c d so this one brings it to um, what's it called bring it to the screen so uh, if you can also edit you press menu again press a little controller and you can it says set software inputs so and then here it says you can either edit the default configurations for all games with four buttons or for this game so I'll just go ahead and put it for this game and like see as you can see here you can move it around you can move your buttons how, however you want them sorry there we go and also the joystick and 
Also, if you hit the little pencil here on the top, it will uh, like make the stick a little bigger or smaller, however you like. Also, the button is the same thing. Um, the macro, macro plus makes the macro a little bigger. Okay, just go ahead and press this one to reset. Or maybe it doesn't reset but or reset to where it was but um, the macro you can actually just make it a little there we go and what you can do you can just go ahead and trash it if you like so let's go ahead and go back there we go and all you have to do is just press any button or the little joystick okay so that's about it guys, um, let me just uh, see if I can exit here real quick. So I press the menu and the red button, confirm. Okay, so we're here. So I'm just gonna go back. And if right now it uh, doesn't have any color, but just you can go ahead and um, reboot or reset. And there we go. Okay, another one that that's very popular would be the Street Fighter Third Strike. There you go, it's downloading. Okay, so it's already downloaded users again you have here you have your matches okay i think you can still uh if you want to add like a bluetooth controller once you're in the in the game you can take off the the buttons also so here press menu the controller and then use controller, just go ahead and highlight it and it takes it off. Okay. I haven't tried the Bluetooth controller yet, but I, it, if it's like other emulators, it will be the same. It will be the same thing. Okay. Um, so that's about it, guys. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, please let me know. And again, this GPO is great for. Uh, online gaming kind of like 5k for android so i'm very excited about this one so maybe we can set up a date so we can play together so let, let me know guys and thank you so much for watching and we'll see you on the next one peace